Well, there was no sound and very little warning. Tonight, a TV helicopter pilot had to make an emergency landing on Boston Common. The chopper set down near the corner of Beacon and Charles. Jonathan Elias joins us there live tonight. Jonathan, witnesses say this came down very quickly. Lisa they didn't have a lot of time. They just turned around. All of a sudden, they hear a helicopter. Next thing you know, boom, there it is right in the middle of the park. But, you know, in the world of flying, they say any landing that you walk away from is a good landing. But the fact that this thing made an emergency landing, the helicopter is not even damaged slightly. The pilot and the photojournalist walked away fine. That makes this a great landing. Looks like a normal news helicopter. It is. But how it got here in the common is anything but normal. I was cleaning the ice, and just as I came off the ice, I saw him coming down really fast, really hard. Thomas Golden was cleaning the ice on the frog pond when he saw the helicopter flying fast and low. And the weird thing? The engine wasn't making any noise. By the time like, he was like very here and very low, it was pretty silent. So I called it in on the radio to my boss that said a helicopter went down in the common, and they thought I was joking. Um, and then we all came out, and we saw it sitting here in complete silence and, like, black. Both the pilot and reporter are fine. The reporter telling me that engine lights went on, and seconds later the pilot was looking for a place to put the helicopter down. He wanted to make an emergency landing as quickly as he could. Because the lights were on, that's what he did. He did it beautifully. He landed in the safest area he could find in the city nearby, and thankfully nobody was hurt. The general manager went on to say that the cameras were actually rolling as the helicopter came down, and when they went back and reviewed the tape, they didn't give it to us because we're the competition, but they said, when you look at the tape, he brought that helicopter down as gently as you'd put a baby in a cradle. Two problems, though, now. One, they can't fly this thing out of here. They have to flatbed it out of here. And two, they better do it quick because the storm is coming and they want to get out of here before the snow starts to fly. Live on the Boston Common, I'm Jonathan Elias, WBC News. Lisa, back to you. All right, competition aside, we're glad everybody's okay. Jonathan, thank you. That news helicopter, by the way, is new. The station has only had it for a week. The FAA is now investigating.